A terrifying attack, a teen girl doused with gasoline and threatened to be set on fire. Now the teen's ex-boyfriend and his 27-year-old friend are facing charges. News Channel 5's Kyle Haran is in our 5 Alert Center. Kyle, fortunately, the victim was not hurt. Right, but listen to what she went through. The victim is a 15-year-old girl. Her 17-year-old ex-boyfriend doused her with gasoline and then threatened to light her on fire. That's according to the Rutherford County Sheriff's Office. Here's where it happened on Fall Creek Drive in Murfreesboro. Here's a story according to deputies. They say 17-year-old boy forced his way into the home and threatened to cut off the teenage girl's head. He then demanded $300 from the girl when she couldn't pay. He poured gasoline around the front of the house. Deputies say he continued to pour the gasoline up the steps of the house and into the living room, throwing some on the girl. The teen then pulled out a lighter, ignited it, and held it close to the girl. Now, the girl wasn't alone. Her grandmother and a roommate were in the home. When the grandmother tried to call 911, deputies say the boy grabbed the phone and smashed it on the ground. During all of this, deputies say the teen's 27-year-old friend, Cody Edwards, was standing outside the house with a lit cigarette lighter. Eventually, both suspects fled, and deputies were able to arrest them at Edwards' house in Smyrna. Now, the suspects face multiple charges between the two of them. They include attempted aggravated arson, aggravated burglary, aggravated assault, and interference with a 911 call. The 17 year old was taken to the juvenile detention center and then Edwards was also arrested. He was booked in Rutherford County. He is being held on a $25,000 bond. At the Five Alert Center, Kyle Horan, News Channel 5. Just